Hello everyone, welcome to Testbook Super Coaching and today is our day two of a YouTube crash course where we're going to be looking at banned books. I hope all of you are going to be are able to hear me. I'll also cross check at my end. One second, I'm just logging in again to just see if you can hear me or not. Hi, Devashish. Tahabaz. Oh, perfect. I think the voice is audible. Dominator, Rajneesh, Kasturi. Uh, all right. Good evening, everyone. I hope all of you have revised uh, whatever we were talking about yesterday. So without further ado, let's just quickly get started. Uh, we say start kar dete hai, so that we can uh, make sure that we're able to end the session also on time. A couple of things that are expected out of you uh, for today's session. I'll of course be letting you know about that. So uh, without further ado, let's just quickly get started. Quick announcement. A couple of announcements which are of course important for you. Um, I will tell you quickly. Like I told you, we are already having our score booster batch which is uh, going on where we meet everybody at 8 o'clock. Uh, so, we meet at 8 o'clock. I am just reducing the sound over here. Um, good evening, good evening, good evening. Asha, Shabazz, thank you so much for reminding me. If you have a PDF and 12 PDF, you will get it on the Telegram platform. If you have a PDF, you will get it on the Telegram platform. I will just see whether I am able to put it uh, on that. And in the Shirt Chah Hustlers, I will post it so you will be able to get that. So, tomorrow, I will send you a message about the PDF. If you have a PDF, you will be getting the PDF. Uh, but thanks so much for reminding me. Again, so you don't have to worry about it at all. Okay, so our PDF is going to be ready. Uh, you will be able to get the PDF properly. Okay, okay. Now, today, what is our agenda? Today, our agenda is banned books. Uh, banned books for Machita se dekhenge. We also have a few icebreaker questions for all of you. I hope you have done homework kar liya hoga, kar nahi kiya hai. But don't worry, I'm going to be giving you one more day extra today. And in the class, mein, we'll do a sort of a hygiene check on that. Uh, so that is something that we'll be looking at. I'm just trying to use the pen. Tomorrow I'll try to change this pen tab only. Okay, so many, <laughs> so many uh, clicks have now come. I have to use the eraser. Okay. Anyway, so like I told you, we're meeting everybody for the score booster batch uh, these days. Uh, we are, of course, covering units. Like, for instance, today we looked at Indian writers. Um, we also revised German literature that we covered yesterday. So, if you are comprehensively wanting to get connected, please feel free to connect with all of us. Fine. Uh, okay. So, PDF, don't worry about the PDF at all. You don't have to worry about the PDF. So, uh, this, this I will share it on the Telegram platform. All right. So, we're meeting at 8 o'clock. We're meeting daily at 9.30 p.m. Uh, 9.30 p.m. is where we... Uh, we practice questions because we are also having these classes that go from questions to concepts. So, ye questions to concepts are 9.30 p.m. Pe ho raha hai. Or 8 p.m. every day, what are we covering? 8 p.m. every day, we are covering uh, important topics that are important uh, for from your net examination perspective. Okay? And Monday to Friday, we are meeting at 10.30 p.m. on YouTube. Um, today, our aaj, aaj discussion and that will be on banned books. So, this will continue ho ga. I hope you have revised the concepts that you revised the Let's just quickly review that. First of all, white studies is a concept given by Richard Dyer. Dr. Robin is talking about white fragility. Uh, we spoke about post-colonial theory, the twin agenda of post-colonial theory. We spoke about works like Home Fire by Kamla Shamshi. Uh, we spoke about writers like Tahmina Durrani writing My Feudal Lord. So I hope you have made all the notes of your own notes. And you're all set. Okay, Chal, good evening. Good evening, everyone. So let's very quickly get started. Let's very quickly get started. Okay, Ravi, we also missed all of you. Um, uh, okay, good evening, Devashir. Devashir, I must say, is doing very well in the classroom class. He's working very hard. And I can see. Okay, um, great. Dominator Rajesh is up from Bihar. Uh, so let's quickly get started. Also, Children's Day, by the way, wishing all of you a very happy Children's Day and uh, may the child in you always be there. Just like they say that on a regular basis, you should always have a child sparkling within you. Uh, children's Day, ke liye, there is, of course, this offer that is going uh, on. And in case that you want to use my code, uh, I will also give you quick details about my code. Capital letters, pe, agar aap Mirja likhenge yahan par, that is the coupon code that you can use. Uh, to avail more discounts. So, yeah, this, this 
discovers your people one discovers your people too as well or let me just hide myself so that you can see this entire thing so there's this uh a uh, sale that is going on and you can use my code by the way my code is neerja n w e r j a it's not neeraja it's neerja so aap ye code use kar sakte hain you can actually use this code as well uh, to just make sure that you know in case of you need so your code you can use it fine um uh, so here are the details about the code okay now coming back let me just get myself back let's very quickly move into uh, the first important thing sabse pehle hum introducing the topic for today aaj ka jo topic hai that is on banned books ve kitabe wo kitabe jo ki uh, you know they they were they were not uh, permitted to get access to meet the common people uh, jo books ko censor kiya hua hai please yaad rakhiyega control and censorship has all आपको पता है क्लासिकल रोमन टाइम्स पे रोबर्ट रोबर्ट को एग्जाइल पे भेज दिया गया था सो वट आई एबल टू सी कि बैनिंग का कल्चर जो है सेंसरशिप का जो कल्चर है कोई भी चीज अगर आप अथॉरिटीज के अथॉरिटीज के अगेंस्ट जाके बोल रहे हैं दैट इज कंसिडर्ड टू बी सिडिशियस तो सिडिशन क्या होता है सिडिशन इज वेन यू आर गोइंग अगेंस्ट द स्टेट जब भी आप कोई चीज स्टेट के अगेंस्ट जाके लिखते हैं दैट इज कॉल्ड सिडिशन इससे रिलेटेड आपकी ब्लास्फमी लॉज भी हैं व्हाट इज ब्लास्फमी ब्लास्फमी बेसिकली मींस समथिंग वेयर यू ट्राई टू फर्ट रिलीजियस aspects of people uh, to hum kya dekhte hain there is a culture of a lot of these books that are uh, banned aur ye jo banned books hain they become important aur isko through the course of two days aaj ki class mein hum kuch banned books kare i think you will you will be able to cover five to seven important banned books through the course of this lecture today aur isi topic ko hum log continue rakhenge we will segregate it jaise banned books before 19th century banned books uh, after uh, you know during the 19th century victorian period जैसे मदान गोवारी हो गया या अवेकनिंग बाय केट शोपान हो गया सो यू लेट मोर क्लैरिटी उसी तरह से आपको दो तीन चीजें जो याद रखनी है कि बैन बुक्स जैसे मैं आपको बता रही थी कि ये कल्चर है ये कल्चर है ऑफ बैनिंग द बुक्स ऑल टुगेदर तो आज के एजेंडा में सबसे पहले मैं आपको ये तीन राइटर्स बताऊंगी जो कि काफी पॉपुलर हैं इनकी किताबें बैन हो रखी हैं खालतो सैनी की कालक्षाना या सत्रापी की ग्राफिक नॉवेल उसके बारे में भी फर्स्ट पॉलिस इस is also banned work that you are able to see so hum log ye banned books pehle main aapko ye teen banned books batungi fir aapka ek ice break ka quiz hai uh, aur ice break ka quiz uh, drama ke upar hai and uh, kal ka jo ice break ka quiz hoga jo main aapko aaj homework de rahi hu jo kal aur aaj ke homework ka uh, milkar hai us pe based kal ka quiz hoga so be prepared for that as well fine uh, okay <clears throat> now very important whenever we are uh, not audible oh god is it ओके नो इट इज ऑडिबल ठीक है बहुत स्केर है था और मैंने कभी आज ये एयर प्लग्स को साइड नहीं रख दिया है सो दैट दे डोंट गेट कनेक्टेड जैसे वो कनेक्ट होते हैं टू यू नॉट एबल टू हियर ओके नाउ व्हेन वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट बैंड बुक्स बैंड बुक्स में से एक शो बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट बैंड बुक आपकी आती है दैट इज एक्चुअली अ बुक दैट इज आजकल भी व्हेन वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट यू नो द द एंटायर वर्ल्ड इज इज लिटरली अगेन लुकिंग बैक एट द पैलेस्टीनियन इशू द गाजा स्ट्रिप हमास Iran, Iraq, so Israel, Palestine. So, these all these things are coming back. It has come into uh, you know mainstream media. Everybody is talking about it. Uh, and uh, you know, Iran, the beautiful country, has always been um, at the center of some sort of turmoil. So, here, one of the most famous band writer of the 20th century, 21st century that you have, that is. मुरजानी सत्रापी सो सत्रापी की जो वर्क है 2013 की जो बुक है ग्राफिक नॉवल है फर्स्ट पॉलिस या आपको इजिली किसी भी बुक शॉप में भी मिल जाती है इट वॉज इमीडिएटली बैंड इन ईरान इसको ईरान में बैन कर दिया गया था बाई द वी ग्राफिक नॉवल्स इंडियन राइटर्स की भी पॉपुलर हो रही है अडल्ट राइट रीडर्स उनके पास कम टाइम होता है ग्राफिक नॉवल्स बेसिकली क्या है आपके जैसे आर्ट चीज वगैरह आ रही हैं कॉमिक बुक्स लिखी जा रही हैं दोज आर ग्राफिक नॉवल्स वो टेल्स आपको ग्राफिक और डिटेल्स में बता रहे हैं सो ग्राफिक नॉवल्स इंफोग्राफिक टेल्स जैसे जब आप समरीज पढ़ते हैं कोर्स हीरो से सो कोर्स हीरो के अंदर एक आपका एक सेगमेंट आता है जिसमें आप इंफोग्राफिक्स ले सकते हैं बाई दी उसको यूज किया कीजिए कोर्स हीरो में आप दो तीन समरीज एवरी डे उठा लिया कीजिए या आपका प्लान में शामिल होना चाहिए ठीक है मैं उसके ऊपर एक वीडियो भी बना दूंगी ताकि आपको पता चले 
ओके सो प्लीज यहाँ पर याद रखना प्लीज इसको थोड़ा सा ध्यान में रखिएगा दैट वेन एवर वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट वेन एवर वी आर डिस्कसिंग बैंक बुक सो अफकोर्स प्रिंसिपल बिकम्स अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग एंड इट इज लाइन्स ठीक है इन लाइन्स को एक बार देखिए सो दैट यू अंडरस्टैंड द द ग्रेविटी ऑफ द सिचुएशन इट इज बेस्ड ऑन द स्टोरी ऑफ माई लाइफ so it is not some stuff that is made up to make kids scared these things exist in the world ya aapko kis lines ko reminiscent karwa raha hai agar aapko yaad aa raha hai to sadhan rasan mantra ne bhi yahi kaha tha that if you think my stories are absolutely graphic and gory and grotesque let me tell you my times were gory grotesque agar aapko meri kahaniyan sadhan rasan mantra ne ye bola tha agar aapko meri kahaniyan jo hai wo bilkul scary lag rahi hain achhi nahi lag rahi hain to main aapko bata dun ki mera time hi ऐसा था जो मैं लिख रहा था आई वाज टू सी ऑल ऑफ दीज थिंग्स राइट सो अगेन जैसे ह्यूमन काइंड में ह्यूमैनिटी दिखती है फिलैंथ्रोपी दिखती है तो वहीं पर ही सर्वाइवल इंस्टिंक्ट और काफी सारे टेल्स इसके बारे में बताते हैं सो so, सत्रापी आपको यही बता रहे हैं सत्रापी सीज दैट यू नो इफ यू थिंक दैट आई एम मेकिंग अप समथिंग इट्स नॉट ट्रू दिस इज माय स्टोरी और ये जो वर्क है प्रिंसिपल ये जो बैंड था ईरान के अंदर व्हाट इज दिस वर्क ट्राइंग टू एक्चुअली टेल यू दिस वर्क इज ट्राइंग टू टेल यू अबाउट लाइफ इन ईरान ड्यूरिंग द स्टार्ट ऑफ द इस्लामिक रेवोल्यूशन एंड द एंड ऑफ ईरान इज़राइल ईरान इराक वॉर दैट वाज गोइंग ऑन तो ये जो टर्बुलेंट टाइम्स है इन टर्बुलेंट टाइम्स में आम लोगों की स्टोरीज बताई जा रही हैं एंड दैट इज बीन द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट फीचर इवन ऑफ पोस्ट कोलोनियल राइटिंग्स ठीक है तो आपका प्रिंसिपलियस बिकम्स वन बैंड एग्जाम्पल ऑफ अ बुक दैट यू आर हैविंग उसी तरह से खालिद हुसैनी वॉज कंसिडर्ड टू बी अ पार्क ब्रेकिंग राइट आई ट्राई टू हाइट माई सेल्फ वेल इनकी जो डेब्यू नॉवल थी कल्ट्राना दैट इज ऑल्सो बीन अ नॉवल दैट इज बैंड इमीडिएटली इन अफगानिस्तान वेन इट केम अफगानिस्तान वेल यू प्लेड वेरी वेल Uh, in the world cup they first could not qualify for semi finals but i think it was spectacular uh, the way that they played uh, now when you're talking about this afghan american writer khalid husaini khalid husaini ye jo story leke aa rahe hain kai runner kai runner kiske bare mein hai amir aur hasan ke bare mein hai ye do boys hain jo grow up karte hain hazara jo ek community hai isi ki wajah se ye ban ho gayi thi ye ban iski wajah thi ki ye keh rahe the ki hamari community ko galat light mein dikhaya ja raha hai they not showing our community in proper light or together right so yes prabhu pandey we will talk about all of that so hum kya dekh pate hain ki again look at look at what he is saying there are things in the book that are of serious nature but i feel the kids have the intellectual capacity to deal with those things ठीक है वो बताना चाह रहे हैं कि आई नो के काफी सीरियस चीज है मैं यहाँ पर बता रहा हूँ पर्टिकुलरली बात हजारों कम्युनिटीज और इन्होंने ही यू नो मैं टॉकिंग अबाउट थाउजेंड स्प्लेंडेड सॉन्ग्स अगेन दोनों के ऊपर आपके क्वेश्चन एग्जाम में पूछे जा चुके हैं सो खालिद सैनी पे नेट पे क्वेश्चन आ भी चुका है एंड आई आई हाइड माई सेल्फ सो दैट यू आर एबल टू सी दिस इन टाइम ऑफ स्लाइड प्रॉपरली सो एज यू आर एबल टू सी आई आई थिंक आई ऑल्सो रिड्यूज रिमूव दिक अप फॉर मिनट तो दिस इज इट आई थिंक इफ यू वॉन्ट टेक स्क्रीन शॉट again otherwise i'll just be sharing the pdf so debut novel khalid husaini ki the novel of course became a critical success but it was banned in afghanistan just like uh, aapka uh, you know persepolis was banned in iran when it came similarly khalid husaini ki kalchana was also banned in afghanistan when it had come ठीक है, so please remember that, please keep that in mind because a lot of times ये जो banned books होती हैं, uh, they they are of course becoming the backbone. Then again, you know, Alex Shafak is a writer which हम लोग या तो आप लोगों ने पढ़ा होगा Shafak को या you always या किसी भी bookstore में जाएंगे, fiction के अंदर आपको Alex Shafak दिखेंगे ही दिखेंगे, right? Just like आपको uh, you know um, uh, you know um, um, even 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 for that matter, a lot of these writers, Marako Mini, so all of these writers are always there. ना सिर्फ लिटरेचर के स्टूडेंट्स पर नॉन लिटरेचर स्टूडेंट्स भी इनको पढ़ते हैं एंड बस्टर्ड ऑफ इस्तानबुल इज अगेन अनदर टेल दैट वाज एक्चुअली बैंड राइट सो ऑल ऑफ दीस राइटर्स दिस इज सेटिंग द कॉन्टेक्स्ट व्हेन फ्रैंक टेल यू इज के ऐसा नहीं है ये बैनिंग सिर्फ रेनेसांस के टाइम पर होती थी ऐसा नहीं है कि बैनिंग जो आपकी थी दैट वाज ओनली एंड ओनली देयर ड्यूरिंग द टाइम ड्यूरिंग द टाइम जब आपका यू नो ओवरऑल सेटअप हो रहा है रेनेसांस का रिमेंबर कंट्रोल एंड सेंसरशिप इज आल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट आपके लिए क्या चीज इंपॉर्टेंट है आपका जो कंट्रोल एंड सेंसरशिप है कंट्रोल एंड सेंसरशिप इज आल्सो इक्वली इंपॉर्टेंट 
रेनेसांस में जो हो रहा है बट आप देख पा रहे हो कि ट्वेंटी सेंचुरी में भी बुक्स बैन हो रही है ट्वेंटी सेंचुरी में भी बुक्स बैन हो रही है एंड दैट मीन्स द रूल एंड सेंसरशिप सिर्फ रेनेसांस से ही सीमित नहीं था ओके सो दैट इज वॉट रेडियो टू सी हियर फर्स्ट एलेक्ट्रिकास्टर ऑफ इस्तान बोल टेलिस फोर जनरेशन ऑफ वेमेन हु आर लिविंग इन इस्तान बोल राइट एंड वो पूरी अपनी स्टोरी बता रहे हैं दैट इज हाउ दे आर गेटिंग देर पास्ट ऑल टूगेदर राइट सो दैट इज समथिंग दैट यू रेडियो टू लार्जली सी Now, अब ये कॉन्टेक्ट सेट करने के बाद आपके कुछ आइस ब्रेकर क्वेश्चन आ रहे हैं ये जो आइस ब्रेकर क्वेश्चन है या फिर ड्रामा के यूनिट से हैं आपको ड्रामा को भी अच्छी तरह से कवर करना चाहिए यू शुड कवर ड्रामा प्रॉपरली बिकॉज जितना अच्छी तरह से आप ड्रामा को कवर करेंगे यू विल बी एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड यू नो दूसरा अप्रोच ऑफ ड्रामा अ लिटिल बेटर वी विल ऑफकोर्स बी लुकिंग एट ड्रामा सेक्रेटरी ऑल्सो ऑन द यूट्यूब प्लेटफॉर्म तो उससे भी आपको होपफुली हेल्प मिलेगी प्लीज लेट मी नो इन द चैट बॉक्स गुड इवनिंग सुनाली गुड इवनिंग चलिए जल्दी से बताइए वर्ड इज द राइट आंसर वो हियर वर्ड इज द राइट आंसर वो हियर इन विच प्ले बाई यूरोपीज द ट्रोजन वेमेन लिमेंट ओवर द कॉप्स ऑफ हेक्टर हेक्टर किसके हसबेंड थे हेक्टर एंड्रोमके के हसबेंड थे हेक्टर वॉज द हसबेंड ऑफ एंड्रोमके ही इज द ब्रदर ही इज द ब्रदर ऑफ ही इज द ब्रदर ऑफ पैरिस हु गेट्स हु अबडक्ट्स हेलेन ऑफ ट्रॉय अब आप यू नो हेलेन को अपडाप्ट कर लेते हैं एक और चीज आपको याद रखनी है दैट हेक्टर किल्स पेट्रोपोलिस जिसकी वजह से एक्टलीज पागल हो जाते हैं राइट एंड दैट इज द रीजन वी से वट इज इलिया बिल्कुल सही जवाब यहाँ पर आ गया ट्रोजन विमेन इज द करेक्ट आंसर ओके यहाँ पर वॉट इज द करेक्ट आंसर द करेक्ट आंसर दैट यूर हैविंग इज ट्रोजन विमेन Trojan women is the right answer. Hector ka, you know, uh, the Trojan women are weeping. And 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 remember, after uh, Priam gets the body of Hector, uh, that is where Iliad is ending with twelve days ka games. Classroom students, if you remember, how is the Iliad ending? The Iliad starts in Medea's rest. It starts in Medea's rest in the middle of the action. Medea's rest may start with that. And how does it conclude? It concludes with a period of truce. Truce ka kya matlab hota hai? When two people who are fighting, they come and they agree ki ham thodi din tak war ko. रुक जाएंगे दैट इज अ ट्रूस राइट इट एंड्स विद दिस ट्रूस टोजन वेमेन बाय यूरोपीज दैट इज व्हाट वी आर एबल टू सी सो दिस इज द थर्ड थर्ड ट्रेजेडी ऑफ अ ट्रिलॉजी दैट इज डीलिंग विद द ट्रोजन वॉर ऑल टुगेदर तो जो पूरा का पूरा आपका जो ट्रोजन वॉर है फर्स्ट ट्रेजेडी कौन सी है एलेक्सेंड्रस एलेक्सेंड्रस ठीक है दिस इज यू नो दिस इज अबाउट द ट्रोजन प्रिंस पैरिस हु इज अबैंडेंड इन इन्फेंसी देन ही वाज अगेन यू नो उनको पानी के दोबारा से मिल गए थे एंड देन ही कॉजेस अ लॉट ऑफ प्रॉब्लम्स देन पैलोमिडीज इज द सेकंड पार्ट ओके व्हिच इज डीलिंग विद द ग्रीक मिसट्रीटमेंट ऑफ द फेलो पैलोमिडीज राइट एंड यहां पर यू नो दिस इज प्रेजेंटेड एट द डायनिसियस ओके एंड अब सात्रो प्ले भी हो रहा है विमेन को बता रहे हैं विमेन आर क्राइंग देयर वीपिंग दीस ट्रोजन वुमेन हेक्यूबा Uh, the queen of priam or andromache all of these cassandra cassandra was taken as a spoil of war that you are able to see i'll hide myself so that you are able to see the entire answer as well i'll hide myself up ek bar dekh bhi liye so that you get better clarity all together so ye teenon parts yaad rakhiyega alexandros palmides and the trojan women theek hai aur kaun kaun si trojan women aapko dhyan mein rakhni hai you need to remember hecuba you need to remember andromache and के हेक्टर के बारे में कैसेंड्रा आपको पता होना चाहिए शी इज द डॉटर ऑफ किंग प्रायम एंड हेक्यूबा ओके शी इज टेकन बाय एगोमेमनॉन ये किसके ऑन लेके चला जाता है इनको एगोमेमनॉन लेके चला जाता है एंड तभी आपको पता भी चलता है जो व्हेन व्हेन वी आर सीइंग एगोमेमनॉन्स प्ले uh that is also especially you like her hand the restrict trilogy there also you are able to see that she comes in fine so uh please keep that in mind do remember trojan women when they are actually weeping uh when they see hector's corpse okay okay moving on to the next question this is the next question <coughs> that i'm telling you drama is important understanding drama we will be ye kadulu ki jo book hai ansan drama we will be practicing this not just that couple of other books also we will be looking at so drama ko achhi tarah se youtube pe bhi cover karenge which of the following plays is characterized by exclusivity of a single character 
टॉकिंग टू हिम सेल्फ ये कैरेक्टर अपने आप से बात कर रहा होता है वट इज द राइट आंसर वेरी गुड हर्ष देसाई का आंसर आ गया है एंड हर्ष देसाई जैसे तिथि ने पहला आंसर तिथि ने सही दिया था ओके फर्स्ट आंसर तिथि हैड गिवन इट करेक्ट एंड नाउ हर्ष हैज आंसर्ड इट करेक्टली वेरी गुड हर्ष तो हर्ष हैज आंसर्ड दिस आंसर करेक्टली क्रैप्स लास्ट टेप इज एब्सोल्युटली द राइट आंसर दिस वाज अ प्ले रिटन बाय सैमुअल बेक हु सैमुअल बेक ही इज एन आयरिश प्ले राइट राइट नोन फॉर वेरी फॉर फोटो अब्सर्ड लिटरेचर पूरा का पूरा सो क्रैप्स लास्ट टेप जो है दैट इज एब्सोल्युटली द राइट आंसर ए कैरेक्टर टॉकिंग टू हिमसेल्फ राइट ए कैरेक्टर हु इज टॉकिंग टू हिमसेल्फ दिस इज रिटन दिस इज अ पार्ट ऑफ द सेम ट्रेडिशन एज थिएटर ऑफ अब्सर्ड थिएटर ऑफ अब्सर्ड की क्या-क्या फीचर्स हैं What are the features of theater of absurd? अभी भी हम लोग कर रहे थे रिमेम्बर क्लासरूम क्लास में नौ बजे नो आठ बजे अरुण जोशी हुज रेप्रेजेंटिंग इंडियन एक्सिस्टेंशियलिज्म इंस्पायर्ड बाय अल्बर्ट कमू हम लोग वी वर टॉकिंग अबाउट ऑल दीज पॉइंटर्स एज वेल एक्सिस्टेंशियलिज्म अब्सर्डिटी अब्सर्ड लिविंग इनके फीचर्स क्या होते हैं अब्सर्ड ड्रामा के मार्टिन एजलिन अपने ऐसे Uh, the theater of absurd me batate hain they have sparse characters settings are also sparse that's what you need to see so overall uh, we are able to look at ki there are a few features of these plays that we are able to look at theek hai so please yahan par yaad rakhna scrap uh, crap ka jo failed aspiration hai crap failed aspiration and his decision to live in a world of solitude rather than creating a balance between life of privacy and emotional content ye sari cheeze aati hain so same person speaking to him Set, right the same person is speaking to himself this is the next question that we are able to see please answer this question and do tell me what is the right answer craps last day happy days waiting for godo end game inke kya kya settings aap dekh pa rahe hain uh, what is it that you are able to look at <coughs> please answer it So sorry. Who's afraid of Virginia Woolf? Yes. Uh, who's afraid of Virginia Woolf is also an example of comedy of menace that is written, of course, uh, in the American style. So uh, Edward Albee is the writer who's associated with it. Very nice point. अभी तक सही आंसर मिला नहीं है अभी तक सही आंसर मिला नहीं है आप इसमें इलिमिनेशन मेथड भी यूज कर सकते हैं ठीक है यू कैन एक्चुअली यूज इलिमिनेशन मेथड इज वेल तो जैसे वेटिंग फॉर गोडो यू नो इज 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 द मोस्ट कॉमनली नोन वो कंट्री रोड ट्री सबको पता है बट क्रैप क्लास टेप का क्या है इट इज अ लेट इवनिंग इन इन फ्यूचर राइट लेट इवनिंग इन द फ्यूचर दैट इज व्हाट यू आर एबल टू सी वेरी गुड रवि पांडे ने सही दे दिया अमृता वानी ने सही दे दिया है एब्सोल्युटली राइट दे दे आर करेक्ट दे आर बैंग ऑन करेक्ट राइट सो व्हाट आर यू एबल टू सी यू आर एबल टू सी दैट क्रैप्स लास्ट टेल्स का है लेट इवनिंग इन फ्यूचर वाइ देन हैप्पी डेज इज एक्सपेंस ऑफ स्कॉच ग्रास फॉर्मिंग अ लो माउंट अ ब्लाइंडिंग लाइट वेटिंग फॉर गोडो कंट्री रोड माउंट एंड अ ट्री एंड गेम में क्या देख पा रहे हैं एंड गेम डायलॉग टू हिम सेल्फ ये क्वेश्चन अभी आया हुआ था राइट दिस वॉज द क्वेश्चन और ये अपने पास को जाके देख रहा है ही इज रीविजिटिंग हिज पास क्लासरूम स्टूडेंट्स कैन यू राइट डाउन द नेम ऑफ द वर्क द राइटर दैट वुमन हैड रिटन रिमेंबर एलिफेंट्स से रिलेटेड टू फैक्टर हेल्प यू रिमेंबर व्हेन ही गोस ही क्रिएट्स दिस मशीन दैट कैन टेल हिम अबाउट हिज मेमोरी व्हाट इज द वर्क दैट वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट ओके सो ये यहां पर आपको याद रखना है हैप्पी डेज इज द प्ले अबाउट विनी द प्रोटैगोनिस्ट हु इज बरीड अप टू चेस in prison she chooses to do nothing to expel herself she is like she is accepted it waiting for godo again theme of existentialism vladimir and estrogon are the two people who are coming in right end game ke andar aapko ham and cloak ka character dikh raha hai ye please agar aap kuch bhi aur nahi padh rahe ho at least iska ek screenshot le lena main aapko pdf to de dungi kam se kam iske to aap notes bana lena ki best ke other plays kaun kaun se hain theek hai at least itni information to aap rakh hi lena ho sake to ek baar ye sare plays इसको ऑक्सफोर्ड कंपेनियन से भी कम से कम कर लेना दिस विल बी वेरी हेल्पफुल फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू ठीक है तो थोड़ा सा टाइम बना के नोट्स अपने दीजिए यस वेरी गुड रवि पांडे 
दैट इज इंपॉर्टेंट चलिए नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन पे आ जाते हैं लेट्स लेट्स क्विकली कम ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन हियर यू हैव द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन आई वांट ऑल ऑफ यू टू आंसर इट इन ऑल ऑफ द रूट्स विद सिस्टम्स टू कंकर द टाइटल रेफर्स टू द स्टूपिंग डाउन ऑफ व्हिच कैरेक्टर स्टूपिंग डाउन ऑफ व्हिच कैरेक्टर स्टूपिंग डाउन ऑफ व्हिच कैरेक्टर कौन से कैरेक्टर का स्टूपिंग डाउन दिखाया गया है व्हिच कैरेक्टर स्टूपिंग डाउन इज शोन इन ऑल ऑफ द रूट्स विद सिस्टम्स टू कंकर द टाइटल रेफर्स टू द स्टूपिंग डाउन ऑफ द स्टूपिंग डाउन ऑफ व्हिच कैरेक्टर चलिए वेरी गुड बोलू नाइस चलो जल्दी बताइए वॉट इज द राइट आंसर द स्टूपिंग डाउन ऑफ रिमेम्बर दिस कैरेक्टर वॉन्ट्स टू ट्रैप मार्लो राइट एंड दैट इज वॉट वी आर वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट एंड आज मैंने आपको बताया था रॉबर्ट्स Uh, by Skiller, Roberts by Skiller is starting this kind of mellow drama. That is what you were able to see. What is the right answer over here? What is the correct answer over here? Very good. You can say the answer over here. Vishal, Vishal, Sunali, Supratim. Everybody has given the right answer. Very good. Sunali is the first one. Yeah, Keith Har Castle is the right answer over here. So in Ghost Man, she stoops to conquer. The title refers to the stooping down of which character? The stooping down of Keith Har Castle. Again, Ghost Man's theme. They are also equally important that you are able to look at. So uh, please keep this in mind. Kate Hart Castle is the right answer. Okay, I'm not able to press this. So Kate Hart Castle uh, becomes the correct answer. Sorry, at least इतने notes तो you better understand. And why she's stooping to conquer? Because you were able to see that he's not comfortable with people of his own class, right? And therefore Kate Hart Castle she pretends to be a barmaid. Okay, and she does that in order to test the feelings of Marlo to make sure that you know he loves her for herself and not for the money. Um, so you know that is what the, she seems to conquer, tries to talk about. Okay, so please make a note of it. The Richard Steele sentimental comedy, The Conscious Lovers, features a preface to the play. Who has written this preface? ये preface किसने लिखा है? Who is the writer who has written this preface? Ah, uh, please याद रखना he is trying to talk about. ये there is a point that is made. ये हम वी आर ट्राइंग टू मूव अवे फ्रॉम अ काइंड ऑफ कॉमेडी जो पहले रेस्टोरेशन टाइम्स पे लिखी जा रही थी तो जैसे कॉमेडी यू आर एबल टू सी इन रेस्टोरेशन टाइम्स उससे अलग जाके कॉमेडी आ रही है इससे डिफरेंट कॉमेडी आ रही है दैट इज वॉट वी वॉन्टेड टू टेल यू तो कुछ पर्सन एसोसिएटेड विद ए वेरी गुड ज्योति इज ऑल्सो डूइंग वेरी वेल इन क्लास रूम क्लास गुड 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 दैट्स नाइस Yes, everybody. What is the right answer? Absolutely right. Absolutely right. B is the right answer. Leonard Weston. ये छोटे से notes बना लीजिएगा. Seventeen. मतलब after restoration drama and up until Oscar Wilde. तो ये छोटे से आप अपने notes बना लीजिएगा. Because ये direct questions आते हैं. इसलिए आपको John Gay का Beggar Supra पूछ लेंगे. या फिर आपको R. B. Sheridan पूछा जा सकता है. या फिर आपको ये sentimental comedies पूछी जा सकती है. तो separate notes बना लीजिए. Questions के through भी क्यों cover this part? It will be fine, ठीक है? इसमें आपको ज़्यादा मेहनत नहीं करनी है। तो after restoration and up until Oscar Wilde is coming and writing comedy of manners, आप इसके separate notes बना लीजिए, जिसमें ये आपका included है। And यहाँ पर as all of you have said, Leonard Bernstein is the right answer. I hope you are able to see the screen. I'll just check whether you are able to see the screen or do I have to? Okay, I'll hide myself. Uh, next time I'll, I'll put it in a particular order only. Anyway, uh, so यहाँ पर preface is written. Preface is written by Leonard Wilson. Okay. और ये क्या कह रहा है? ये कह रहा है हमारा play is not something जो कि common trend के हिसाब से है. You know, it is trying to focus on morality. It is trying to focus on manners. Restoration drama की तरह नहीं है. Restoration drama के ये features थे. These are the features of restoration drama. So he is trying to tell. Wilson is trying to tell कि हमारा जो है वो रेस्टोरेशन ड्रामा से बिल्कुल अलग है रेस्टोरेशन ड्रामा वाज़ अ प्रॉब्लम चाइल्ड ऑफ इंग्लिश राइटिंग्स दैट इज़ व्हाट यू आर एबल टू सी ठीक है तो ये न्यू टाइप ऑफ सेंटिमेंटल कॉमेडी आ रही है दिस इज़ द न्यू काइंड ऑफ कॉमेडी दैट यू आर एबल टू सी एंड अगेन स्टील इज ट्राइंग टू सेपरेट हिज वर्क ही ट्राइंग टू टेल यू कि हमारा वर्क डिफरेंट है ही ट्राइंग टू टेल यू हमारा वर्क जो है काफी डिफरेंट है दैट इज व्हाट ही ट्राइंग टू टेल यू Okay, now moving on to the next question. Kuti, please tell us what is the right answer. Is ka kya sahi jawab hai? Which is the last heroic play by John Ryden, set in India at the time of Mughal Empire, and derives its events and characters from history? What is the right answer over here? What is the right answer over here? Very simple. बहुत ही ज़्यादा simple question है. What is the correct answer here? Quickly, quickly, quickly. But in the last heroic play by John Dryden, set in India at the time of the Mughal Empire, and derives its events and characters from history. Is that what you will say? Shall you tell us about it? What is the correct answer here? 
Very good, very good. Aurangzeb is absolutely the correct answer. Aurangzeb is the right answer over here. I don't think it's the uh, hyphen. So, Aurangzeb is trying, uh, you know, this, this play is trying to tell you about this weak ruler, uh, you know, uh, who's aging, a uh, weak king who's, you know, he, he's finding his throne to be challenged altogether uh, by several of his sons, uh, you know, that, that is that is also coming in. So, again, uh, Pura ka Pura play taking from history and it is also considered to be an important heroic play. Please yaad rakhye ka that when we are talking about uh, overall uh, Dryden's, Dryden's heroic plays, unka drama, how he's getting uh, uh, getting inspired by William T. Evanant, who's famously called as a bastard child of Shakespeare. Uh, he, uh, you know, he's getting inspired by William T. Evanant's style of writing. He's also getting inspired by the French way of writing, jo French ka Cornell ka style hai, uh, of writing tragedies. That is what we're able to see. Rhyme reverse me hai, or Dryden ka jo notion hai about drama in his essay on dramatic poesy, that also becomes important. Okay? So, thoda se yaad rakhi chita, or isko bhi yaad rakhna, Verse okay, during the period from 1663 to 1618, John Dryden wrote 21 heroic plays, identify the features of those plays. So 1663 to 1680, John Dryden was writing 21 heroic plays. John Dryden is writing heroic plays, 21 heroic plays. What features are What are the features that you are able to see? Okay, rhyme reverse. Abhi abhi aapko pata chala. Think of all features. Kya hai? What are the other features that you're able to see? Okay, yes. Fletcher, Fletcher. Uh, so Fletcher, ke jo characters the creating the spectacle, dialogue in heroic couplets. Very good. Ravi Pandi, Shabazz, Dominator, Vishal, Abhishek, Sanali, Sabka, Supratim, Harsh, excellent. Harsh Day Sai is on fire today. Uh, Uttam, uh, AK, English, Kasturi, everybody has got the right answer. So, here all of these are features. This is a feature. This is a feature. Fletcher ki tarah character la rahe hai. So, all of them is absolutely the right answer. I'll hide myself so that you are able to see it better. Uh, but what are you able to look at? You are able to see that all the heroic drama which you are taking is the heroic couplet ke format mein likha hua hai. and you know uh, these plays were uh, written in order to please of course Charles II um, and in, in, you know Charles II ko, because wo French mein kaafi, uh, France had a lot of time in France so Rhyme French drama ka shock Exile me, he, he got, uh, he got, and, and remember what is Charles II called as? Charles the second is famously called as Mary Monarch. So, inko वैसे भी just का लग गया था. Mary Monarch को अच्छा लगता था ये देखना. तो इनको please करने के लिए. So again, spectacle का use हो रहा था. Uh, song and dance था. Warfare was there. This is what we were telling. आज के classroom class में भी आपको याद है? जब हम कह रहे थे कि Faust by Goethe, Goethe in two parts. First part heaven में है. Remember part one की setting मैंने आपको क्या बताया था? Part one की setting heaven के अंदर है. When Mephistopheles is trying to tell God कि मैं आपके favourite child को करप्ट कर दूंगा राइट सो आप देख पाते हो मेलो ड्रामा ये सब चीजें बहुत पॉपुलर हो रही है पीपल आर रियली लाइकिंग ऑल ऑफ दैट राइट एंड ऑफ कोर्स प्लेचेरियन टाइप सेंटिमेंटल नीड्स कैरेक्टर्स हैं उनके इवल वुमन तो कैरेक्टर टाइप्स बन रहे हैं दैट इज व्हाट यू आर एबल टू सी ठीक है कैरेक्टर टाइप्स आर ऑल कमिंग सो ऑल ऑफ देम आर फीचर्स दैट आर इवेंचुअली बीइंग सीन एंड विजिबल Okay, this is a very simple question. Nobody should get this wrong. Everybody should get this right. Barabas is a character from Christopher Marlowe's play called what? Christopher Marlowe ke plays ke liye please flashcards bana uh, Jaise Massacre in Paris se question aara hai. Ya Edward the Second se Gaston ka question aara hai. Uh, ya Jew of Malta se aapka Barabas. So you, you should be. Tamburin se ko question aara hai. Dido Pina Carthage on si books se inspired hai. So iske please flashcards bana lije. Oxford the Paris se bhi agar aap pal denge isko. So that will be fine. You don't really require any other traditional help. So, you can tell me what is the right answer over here. Absolutely correct. Absolutely correct. This is the right answer here. If you have any questions, that means you have to clear the basics to clear the basics. So, please ensure that the right answer is Jew of Malta, the representation of Jews, anti-Semitism. What concept is this? What is this concept of anti-Semitism? Illogical hatred towards Jews, right? Your anti-Semitism is illogical 
anti-Semitism, illogical hatred towards Jews, you have to know. So, Jew of Malta, uh, about Barabbas, he's scheming altogether. What a villain character is one of them. And uh, you are able to see that he doesn't even raise his own daughter as well, right? Uh, so, his own daughter, Abigail, uh, will be, you know, poison. Uh, she also poisons herself. So, that is what we're able to largely see. Okay, again, very simple question. Zada time nahi lagna chahiye yaha par, isko answer karne ke liye. You have to map the works and the authors. Works and authors. Chahiye, jaldi thoda sa karte hai. Because then I want to introduce two or three other banned books as well before going. And then I'll tell you the homework uh, also for today. Chahiye, jaldi, jaldi, let's just do it, everyone. I hope achhi tarah se you're studying. Do let us know any support, help that you require. Comment section mein aap lik sakte hai. Okay. What is the right answer over here? Very good. I think who start getting the right answer? Harsh, Harsh, Sonali, Ravi, Sudharsh, Ravi, Devashesh, Harsh. Very good. Impeccable. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's just see. Spanish tragedy. Paul likh raha hai. Spanish tragedy. Thomas Kidd likh raha hai. So if you are able to use the elimination method, what are you able to see? A to kaha par hai? Aapko aage jane ki bhi zirurat nahi thi. Do minute mein answer sahi aana chahiye tha. So A to aapke sirf A option ke andar hai. That is C option. So aapko aage jana bhi nahi tha. Even if you don't know the other answers, you could have easily answered this question. So please, for us, uh, you know, use your senses also. Sometimes these questions can be cracked by that. So Thomas gets the Spanish tragedy, uh, the story of Horatio who's murdered by Balthasar, uh, Hieronimo is mad again. Okay, so you have to see that you are basically seeing that uh, instead of the, the, the son taking revenge uh, on, on the father's behalf, but the father is taking revenge for his son's death. Uh, in the classroom, mein, yesterday we spoke about Bazarov's character, Bazarov and Arkadi, fathers and sons, uh, Ivan Turnjeev, Kajo character, he's a Russian writer. Uh, 1862, mein, how you're able to say that, you know, fathers and sons is coming, trying to tell you about the clash between old and new Russian values. Bazarov's character is the first nihilist character. So, this is that you are reading revise kije. If you want to revise, things will be tougher. So, Bazaruk's character is the first nihilist character that you are able to see. Okay? So, here uh, that is what you are able to see. Old by Spain is by George Peel, who is also writing The Aragment of Paris. Right? Uh, Thomas Lodge. Thomas Lodge is writing The Wounds of the Civil War. And Robert Greene is writing Prior Bacon and Prior Bombay. ओके okay. ये सारे के सारे आपके क्या हैं ये सारे के सारे आपके यूनिवर्सिटी विद्स हैं जो सेंट स्पेलिंग को कहते हैं यूनिवर्सिटी विद्स ये कहां कहां से आ रहे हैं ऑक्सफोर्ड एंड कैम्ब्रिज से आ रहे हैं रिमेंबर सी एन जी सी एन जी सो क्रिस्टोफर मार्लो थॉमस नैश एंड जॉर्ज Peel, right? So what are you, what are you, uh, sorry, uh, and and your Robert Green, right? They are coming from your Cambridge and LLP, that is your Lily Lodge and Peel, they are coming from Oxford, right? They are coming from Oxford and Thomas Kidd was a person who never went to any university, but he's categorized as university with his sari apke university with and they're also called pre-Shakespearean drama. Shakespeare and si kuch na kuch seek rahe. Ye bhi baut easy question hai, jaldi bataiye, what is the right answer? Jaldi bataiye, what is the right answer over here? Thomas Nashville's The Unfortunate Traveller is narrated by. Ye question bhi aapka net exam ni aar chuka hai. You should know. Easy questions bhi aapke dosi teen hoote hai, which are scoring. But agar aapne revise nahi kiya, to ho galat ho jayenge. What is the correct answer here? Ye to dupe minute lagna chahiye, zada nahi lagna chahiye, is this me? Chale, jaldi se bataiye, what is the right answer over here? Thomas Nashville's The Unfortunate Traveller is narrated by. Jaldi, jaldi, itna time nahi lagna chahiye, is me please. Very good. Thomas Nash's The Unfortunate Traveller. This is narrated by Jack Wilton. This is narrated by Jack Wilton. That is what you are able to see. Okay, it is also an example of picturesque novel, right? Novel which is trying to, uh, trying to educate you by traveling. So, now, just say, after your ice breaking questions, uh, we have been starting with Elish Shafaka, Bastard of Istanbul, Tai Trana, Persepolis, these books that were banned. Uh, there were 
other works also. Can you tell me a few books which were banned in the uh, era before 19th century? So, you can make a timeline. We will cover it completely. We will be talking about we will be talking about all of these uh, books all together. Uh, we will be talking about books that are banned before 19th century. Then, those books which are in 19th century are banned. Then, those books which are in the interwar period are banned. Then, those books which are modern times are banned. So, you will be able to read the structure. Can you tell me the names of a few books that are banned before 19th century? Nineteenth century से पहले कौन-कौन सी books हैं जो ban की गई हैं? Can you tell me the list of some very important books from your net examination perspective जो आपकी ban की गई हैं, which have been banned? You know आपका काफी सारी books भी इस पे आई हैं. There are a lot of these books that are made on banned books all together, right? जो books आपकी ban की गई हैं. इसमें काफी सारा content भी आपका produce हुआ है, right? So you don't have to worry about buying any of these because we we will be teaching you. So but still, in case if you want to, you can. Okay. So what are the names of some of these banned books? Um. Okay. Okay. अच्छा, so ये सारी की सारी जो books हैं, आपको पता है Decameron, so so your Decameron, Canterbury Tales, Wycliffe's Bible, Dialogue on the Two Chief World Systems, Response, Small Flanders, One Twenty Days of Sodom, so you know all of these are books that were banned before 19th century and they were very popular and you have to ask them in your exam. You have to ask them from the mall flanders, you have to ask them from the YTS Bible, you have to ask them from the Canterbury Tales, Zekhanon. So before 19th century, these were some of the very popular books, these were some of the very popular works, these were some of the very popular writings that you were able to see which were banned in your exam, right? You were able to look at how many writers and writers and in this case, अभी इसके अलावा भी आपके बहुत सारे other works भी आते हैं there are a lot of other works also that come in for instance the response is by a writer called Sor Juana Sor Juana Lacuse is writing so ये सारे works आपके 19th century के अंदर उससे पहले आ रहे हैं and they are all banned right Decameron भी एक ऐसा work है that was actually banned जो Tuscan vernacular language में लिखा गया है which also inspired Geoffrey Chaucer and the Canterbury Tales what are you able to see, you are able to see that this is also an example of a banned work, right? Decameron is also an example of banned work. That is what you are able to see. ये work भी आपका banned works में से एक है, ठीक है? तो कई बार क्या होता है? हमें पता ही नहीं है. Sometimes we are not aware about it. But all of these works, all of these works were also actually banned. Right, all of these works were also actually banned. Right, इनको इनको indecent माना गया था, इसको indecent माना गया था. As it is in the religious work के entertainment माना जाता था, तो people were against it. So Decameron की complaints थी, and later on we were able to see the Decameron was again coming back to the canon. Right, you were getting it rescued. Canterbury Tales is also one of the banned works. Canterbury Tales also by Geoffrey Chaucer. Let me see whether you're able to see this or not. Okay, you're not able to see it. Anyway, I'll just hide myself. So even Canterbury Tales, Canterbury Tales also becomes a very important example of a book that was banned. Canterbury Tales में हमें पता है कि you know whenever we we are studying English either in your bachelor's or in your master's you will actually study Canterbury Tales. But do you know that this was also a book that was banned? Right? Tabhi John Fox, abhi mein aapko John Fox ka comment bhi dikha hoongi. So you are able to see that this particular work, this particular work was also a part of the prohibited list of books. So aapka church ne list of books nika li thi, which were considered to be prohibited. So aapki church ne ye books ko consider kiya tha. And yaha par you were able to see that this was also one of the books that the church had considered to be something which needs to be banned altogether. So you can see that we don't have to write anything because we are seeing and we see that it tells you about the society altogether. But it also was actually one of the banned books that was a part of the list of books that were banned by the church as well. 
आप देख पाते हो देर आर लॉर्ड ऑफ दीज राइटर्स लॉर्ड ऑफ दीज राइटर्स वर राइटिंग डायरेक्टर वर्क प्रेजेंटिंग कैरेक्टर्स टॉकिंग अबाउट और कॉमेंटिंग अबाउट यू नो सर्टन इशूज इन द सोसाइटी इज नॉट कि इनको इजिली बोलने दिया जा रहा है दे आर ऑल्सो राइटर्स वर फेसिंग अ लॉट ऑफ क्रिटिसिजम सेंसरशिप जॉन पॉक्स ने ये देखो यहाँ पर जॉन पॉक्स ने क्या बोला है जॉन पॉक्स ने बोला है द बिशप बिलाइक टेकिंग दिस वर्क Uh, but for just toys in condemning other books yet permitted books to be read so you know john fox was also talking about it ke jo bhi church decide karti hai hum usi ko support karne lag jate hain they are the ones who are deciding the curriculum they are the ones who are deciding it so you were able to see that how this book we consider it to be radical because monk ka jo representation hai partner ka jo representation hai ya wife ko baat ka jo representation and that wasn't like that wasn't really like right so you were able to see that it also came under the obscenity charges isko bhi obscenity charge na ko pdf dungi aaj din sab ye sari cheeze ek baar read kar lijiyega whitecliffe's bible also right whitecliffe's bible i'll just take two to three more minutes whitecliffe's bible also you are able to see that that you know because you were saying something different galileo can you believe it galileo just because he said that earth is moving earth is on the center of the universe which was a scientific fact but his work was getting banned so us time pe if you are ahead of your times you are actually getting censured so this is what i wanted to show you of course kal bhi hum log is topic ko continue karenge abhi do writers main aapko aur bata rahi hu kabhi as starting mein i told you ki aisa nahi ki banning sirf pehle hoti thi aur ab nahi hoti hai aur aisa nahi ki ab hoti hai aur pehle hum log bahut acche the even though milton is writing aristocratica which tells you about freedom of press but there wasn't any freedom of press you were at the mercy of the people in power abhi aapne kya dekha dryden spectacle kyu use kar raha tha ya french heroic works ko kyu dekh ke waise hi place bana raha tha to flatter the monarch because charles the second really liked it ab so jo main kuch likh dega milton ki sabhi to when charles came his books were almost about to get burnt so you are able to see that there is no volition at all right there is no volition at all there is no freedom that we are able to see eventually over here okay i'll hide myself again whitecliff bible whitecliff's bible is again another important work that you are able to see jahan par you know banning ho rahi hai uh, you you were able to see that you know anybody who was convicted of heresy was being burnt at stake all together so whitecliff was very controversial right whitecliff was absolutely controversial. Controversial. He he is attacking trans substitutionization, uh, where you know how how ultimately all of these things are getting challenged. I'll also remove the the sticker for a minute. Uh, sorry, uh, sorry. Yeah, I'll also remove this so that you you're able to see. Right. So all of these things are there. Whitecliff's Bible is something which is uh you know which is getting attacked. So again, again, what are you able to see? Even ये ये तो White Whitecliff का Bible banned हो गई है. You are also able to look at कैसे uh you know people like John Purvey are also talking about it. People like John Purvey are also discussing. Right. Even Purvey, John Fox ने जैसा कहा वैसे ही John Purvey also said that. John Purvey said, let the Church of England now approve the true and full translation of simple men. If you are not going to let the simple men know the Bible, it is absolutely injustice that you are perpetuating. Now, before we go, I have a question for all of you, and this is the last band word for today. Who is the writer of the dialogue on the two chief world systems? डायलॉग ऑन द टू ची वर्ड सिस्टम ये किसने ये वर्क लिखा है राइटर ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर वर्क द डायलॉग ऑन द टू ची वर्ड सिस्टम आई विन डायरेक्टली गिवन दी आंसर ऑल्सो सो सर हुआ राइटर ओवर हियर ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर वर्क सो श्री थैंक यू रवि Let me check. Please like the session. Yes, please like uh, and share so that everybody comes to know that I was ready. Started teaching regularly over here because I think a lot of you. Very good, Gunjan. Very nice, Gunjan. Um, Galileo is the right answer. So Galileo is the person who's writing the dialogue on the two chief world systems. ये भी एक ऐसा वर्क था. It was banned. Right? It was completely banned. And why was it banned? It was banned because it was telling you a simple scientific truth, but it was banned. 
राइट इट वॉज एब्सोल्यूटली बैंड राइट सो ये जैसे जैसे फॉर इंस्टेंस इवन इवन द पोलिश एस्ट्रोनोमर निकलस पॉपुलिकस ऑल्सो सेट दैट अर्थ एंड अदर हेवनली बॉडीज दे वर ऑर्बिटिंग अराउंड द सन राइट बिकॉज पहले क्या था पहले दे हैड दे हैड अ थियोसेंट्रिक वर्ल्ड दे हैड अर्थ वॉज एट द सेंटर दैट इज द बिलीव दैट दे हैड सो वेन कलिडी वॉज ट्रेन टू टेल फैम द रियालिटी ही इज समन एंड इज वर्क इज कंप्लीटली बैंड ऑल टूगेदर right uh, so dialogues of the two word two three words becomes a work that is getting banned all together okay and yaha par you know milio also says he even says i have been suspected of heresy of having held and believed that the sun is the center of the world and immovable and that earth is not the center and moves he says this he says that i have been you know i have been the person who's been banned because of saying and acknowledging the truth So I hope control and censorship for you are able to understand. You are able to see how these works are coming. Today I have a very simple ask from you. I want you to uh, cover this. Let me start. Thoda sa as a quick uh, quiz, uh, Lungi. I want you to definitely make sure that you know you take a look at some of the other 19th century band works like Adventures of Huckleberry Finn, Madame Bovary, Leaves of Grass, Awakening. Or we are in detail. Iske under jayenge. Ya between the words, jo books band hui hain, jaise. Ulysses, Lady Chatterton's Lover. I think you guys were in the comments. Maybe dialed it. Brave New World. And Kalka Bumbo continues with both of these PDFs. Today or yesterday's PDF, I will give you. And please, this part of the book complete. Can you check it? If you have not done it, I will ask you some more questions tomorrow. Chapter Nine of Raman Selden. This is the book. This is the same as I have in Telegram channel. It is English Literature Hustlers. It is on it. If you get it, it will be great. I will just hide myself and show it to you. I will give you the Telegram channel. डाल दूंगी एक मैंने आपको ये बता भी देती हूँ नीरशा मैम टेस्ट बुक करके ये जो टेलीग्राम चैनल है आप इस पर भी ये फाइंड कर सकते हैं बट प्लीज टेक अ स्क्रीन शॉट एंड कवर दिस होमवर्क ये दोनों के दोनों जो पीडीएफ्स हैं वैसे मैंने शेयर भी करे हुए हैं Uh, please cover this homework and also cover the homework of your band works. Fine. Right? All right. I'll catch up with all of you tomorrow. Tomorrow is again another interesting day. Uh, we'll be covering another important topic for all of you. In the meantime, please revise whatever we've looked at today. कोई भी doubts होंगे तो please write it in the comment section and let us know any help that you require. And we will be catching up with all of you tomorrow at 10:30 p.m. And take good care of yourselves. Bye. Bye everyone. Thank you so much. रमन सेल्टन आई ऑलरेडी सेंड बच्चे ऑन इंग्लिश लिटरेचर हॉस्पिटल आपको मिल जाएगी वहां पर ठीक है उसमें मैंने पहले से ही भेजी हुई है ओके थैंक यू सो मच गुड नाइट एवरी वन स्वीट ड्रीम्स आई होप कुछ और नहीं है कुछ एनीथिंग एल्स बाय इट इज अ फादर यस थैंक यू थैंक यू सोनाली थैंक्स डोमिनेटर थैंक यू गुड नाइट एवरी वन थैंक यू विशाल थैंक यू गुड नाइट Thank you so much, Ravi. Thank you. Good night, everyone. Sweet dreams. Thanks, Devashish. Devashish, you're doing very well. Good. Thank you.